it definitely tickles. And it also definitely increases natural tear production, like instantly, no question about that. It's the new iTear 100 from Olympic Ophthalmics. Shout out to Dr. Kambi Salani in Beverly Hills, a dry eye specialist. He has every technology in the office, uh, depending on what's gonna be best for you. For me individually, I was looking to get away from the artificial tears with all the preservatives in them. You know, the cheaper tears in the store really aren't that good for you. They have more expensive tears that maybe cost you like 25 bucks a month, depending on how much you're using, could be even more than that. This thing for basically a dollar a day, 30 bucks a month, unlimited use, prescribed basically twice daily, 30 seconds a side, stimulates this nerve. This nerve stimulation technology has been around for quite some time. There was an older device about like 10 years ago that had an you know, electrical stimulation inside the nose. That's not on the market anymore for obvious reasons. This thing's a mechanical stimulation with a vibration. It basically tickles the outside of the nerve, stimulates the production pathway, you increase more basal tears. So for me, what I've noticed, number one, immediate uh, relief for sure, but increased basal tear production throughout the day. So if you're on the computer all day like I am, 10, 12 hours a day for work, at the end of the night, close the computer, go to watch a little bit of TV, I already have like tearing and burning going on. At that point, those tears are inflammatory. It's just a vicious cycle. Instead, you're producing more natural, healthy tears throughout the day. I've noticed I haven't been getting like the breakthrough symptoms throughout the day, and I definitely haven't been having the more severe symptoms at the end of the night. And I've only had this thing for three days. So no question in my mind, you can get it a couple different ways. You purchase the device directly from the doctor or you can go on site, uh, the website and check it out there. And uh, you'd have to do like a telehealth visit in order to get a prescription for it. Or you can go ask a doctor for a prescription. They can write a prescription.